What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Lorna Marie. I feel so good being back. This is 2023, new year, new me. This is all about health, fitness. I'm sharing my bag with you guys today, which you guys know, they call me the kit queen here. So your girl's gonna show you how I organize it, what's inside of it, and why all the things inside are important to me. 2022 was all about me healing the inside, childhood traumas, facing my shadow, and this year is going to be all about health in my body and we're going to learn how to integrate the two together which I'm so excited so if you guys are interested this video today is going to be I'm going to take you guys along with me I'm going to show you guys where I work out my gym I'm a full-time RVer I'm a mom of four if you guys don't know that so it is pretty interesting how I have to maneuver all of this so if I can do it I know you guys can this is our year I'm excited to get healthy let's do this together and without further ado let's hop into that video. We are back inside my kitchen. I'm going to show you guys what's inside my bag. I'm going to show you guys some of my favorite supplements. We're going to talk about some things and let's get right into it. All right. So first off, I need to take my vitamin. I actually take Ritual. If you guys want a discount code, I am not sponsored or affiliated with them. Let me know in the comments below and I can try to get one for you guys. But Ritual is the best. It actually has your oils, your vitamins, everything inside of this capsule. It's so good for you. I did so much research on which one I was gonna take and Ritual is the one I landed on. I try to drink four of these a day. It's my half my body weight, ideal body weight in ounces of water. Okay, so the first product that I like to do is this amazing grass greens blend. And I just got done reading a book by Sean Stevenson. I will link that down below. It's called Eat Smarter and it will really like change your perspective on food. And it's like, he doesn't say there's evil food, which I love. It's actually a very healthy way to look at food. It's not about what you eat. It's about what you don't eat. So getting things like this in so you can get the nutrients so you're building new cells, you're helping your sleeping patterns and all those things. So I think this is really good, but it only has 25 calories, four grams of carbs and two, zero grams of sugar. So I think this is such a good trade off for the calories and the carbs. So what you do is there's like a little thing in here, a little scooper. And I'm gonna scoop this inside of here. So I just poured this in here. They actually have these really cute little funnels you can get if you always do them in water bottles. But anyways, so that is this thing here. And then to that, I add chlorophyll drops. Chlorophyll helps you. It aids in detoxification. It may help boost your immune system, improves red blood cell quality. It also supports healthy skin. And I don't know about weight loss. I would not have that claim. That's what it says here, but you never know. Um, it neutralizes body odor. It may increase energy. So yes, please. So what I do is it says three pumps and then I'm just doing them together so I can just get it out of the way. And then I just shake this bad boy. You can use a shaker cup, do whatever you want then at night I've been taking this calm it has magnesium in it most of us are low in magnesium like the soil isn't as good as it used to be so magnesium helps sleep it helps you not be constipated you have to be pooping at least once a day if you're not get on it because your digestion is so important it's where you like grab onto those nutrients and all that good stuff so calm at night. I almost forgot to show you guys. I also take this in the morning before I eat anything. It is by seed. This is the best probiotic. I've been doing a lot of research and this one has two capsules, one inside of another capsule and it helps so it gets to your second intestine. I'm pretty sure that's why. So that way it gets the nutrients to the place in your intestines where it needs to go. So this is such a good one. I actually, this is my husband's. I just ran out of mine because I use it every single day. So those are all the supplements. And now we're going to get into the bag. Are you guys ready? Oh, I feel so crazy. Like actually doing a bag or a kit for you guys. Now you already know how your girl does it. I'm going to give you an aerial shot. You're going to see how it's all packed inside of here. I'm gonna give you a little peek first. Should we do the small one first or the big one? I'm gonna just do the big one first. Okay, so here is the inside of this bag here. Now I got this little Nike bag. I don't want like a huge gym bag because like I honestly, when I go to the gym, I hang this on the treadmill when I'm warming up and it's just so light, you guys. Like I'm like, 
I don't even think it's three, it's three pounds maybe, if that. It's just, it's so light and I'm very grateful for that. Okay, first thing I have in here in the very front is I have some gloves. These are super old. Almost everything here is from Amazon. But I have some gloves for the weights. Then in the front, I have this. I didn't put my powder in here yet, but this is for protein powder. So it has this little spout thing here and you can pour your protein powder so much easier inside of things. I actually have a bunch of these. I bring these to the movie theater. I put snacks inside of them and it's great for like portion control, you know? Then on the left-hand side here, I have this pill case and I just put extra pills like I take my probiotics in the morning before I eat anything and I just want to put extra ones in here. Oh, I can use these up until I order my other ones, but I put them in here just in case I forget them at home. I have them in my gym bag, so that's important to me. Oh, and a hack. These little things that you get in the bottles, you guys, I put them in here. These little tabs to keep them dry. I stuck one in here to absorb moisture, but I love the color. It's kind of like a taupey goldish color. All right, then in the front, now this is gonna be controversial. I have not even used this yet, I just bought it, but the gym that we are members at, because we're full-time RVers, we have gyms all over the place that we can go to, they have a tanning bed. And sometimes if I haven't tanned so I don't get burnt, I will actually tan in a tanning bed. So I keep a little pair of glasses and then I have my tanning solution right here and then on the right hand side I have this little zip pouch now this is um, I think this is from Target but I just have these are my favorite protein bars you guys Quest usually is very dense but these ones are light and airy like a Rice Krispie highly suggest I even bring those to the movie theater if I want to have like the flavor of a candy bar and then I have some of these little peanut butters there's a couple in here that actually are protein like this one has protein in it but I just keep these in here because some days like I won't have a protein shake in the morning I'm like oh my gosh I should have had a protein shake and I'm dying so I don't like to work out on an empty stomach that just doesn't work out for me I get too antsy for food and then I want to leave so I have to have a little something in my stomach in the back on the left we have I am in love with these we have these workout bands so the first one they're all different strengths so one is super light which is this one here this little light pink one then the medium which is this pink snakes uh, snake print then we have pink leopard print which is the strongest one so I love these you guys I use them all the time I do it when I'm using light weights I'll just do squats or uh, lunges and these are my favorite new thing I have in my bag and I use them all the time they're actually getting slightly dingy but that means because they're well loved and and then last thing in the big pocket here is my new jump rope I love jump roping, you guys. It is so much fun. And I've been watching all of them on TikTok, like which which brand should I get? And this is one of the brands, but this is one of the ones they said to get a weighted one or the ones with the beads. And I'm like, I'm going beads. This reminds me of my childhood. And it just gets your heart rate going so fast. So if you wanna do like workouts or if you wanna do weights and do this in between while you're waiting or whatever, it's, it's so good. Okay, so next up we have the front pocket here. And we are gonna go from front to back. So we just have wipes in the front. Makeup wipes, I don't normally have makeup on at the gym, but for some reason, if I did, if I forgot to take it off and went out at night and I still ended up at the gym, I could take it off. Um, Clorox wipes, you never know what you need to wipe down. I have some booty wipes, which is hilarious name. And then I have this little pouch here. So you guys already know, like I always have extra, extra stuff all the time. I feel like I do have a good amount of stuff in here, but I wanted to keep it super light. So I just have like the bare necessities. So I have hair ties, we have um, little day pads, and then I have a comb. And then I just have one tiny little perfume. And that's literally all I have. This is actually goes into a planner and I cut the little holes off on the side. Okay, and then I have toilet seat covers. I feel like that's important to me because I'm not sitting my butt on that while people are working out. I have Hanale. This is the best, you guys, if you have not tried it. It is a lip treatment. This is in rose. Gotta get the rose color. And then I have some Hemp's Honey Bear. This is some lotion. Let's put some on right now. 
Oh, you guys, what is this scent? This is sweet jasmine and apple blossom. It smells so good. Oh my gosh. And just, you guys, how cute is this little bear? This is literally the cutest. I want to open a shop and sell like all kinds of cute little things you can have in your purse. I think that's, that's going to be the goal. All right. Last but not least, I have a hairbrush. This is a wet brush. I'm pretty sure this was Amazon too. It's a little bit older, but push it like that. It's got a little mirror and yeah, that's about it. All right. So that is everything that I have in here. You guys also, when I link things, this is going to be new to people that have been here a while. There will always be a blog post at the bottom that has one link. That one link will take you to my website and it will have all the products linked there. It actually helps me get traffic to my website when I do it that way. So you guys will hit the link and it will take you to all of the products there. I just wanted to say to you guys that for me, I was on such a huge journey for physical, for physical health about a year ago, a year and a half ago. And I was looking to lose weight and all of that stuff. And it really led me to my huge spiritual awakening. If you guys have not seen that video, I will link it down below. I took a break then too. I took like a six month break, but it's been feeling so good. You guys taking a break, um, and like healing the inside, making sure everything is good. Mental health, spiritual health, all of that is in line before I can do stuff like this. I cannot pour out into other things in my life. If my cup is not full and so I'm just at a healthy place right now I feel the best I felt in the last five years I feel younger I have more energy I feel absolutely amazing and if I could give this gift to anybody this is what I would give you all of the reason that I feel the way that I feel it is not because I lost a huge abundant amount of weight it's because I worked on my healing my healing my childhood trauma and loving myself oh my gosh you guys my relationship with myself is just chef's kiss amazing I love myself so much and that sounds really weird to even say that out loud because I feel like you're taught to like not love yourself and that's conceited and nope 110% love myself love who I am and I just hope in this new year 2023 that you guys can find a place where you just love everything about yourself like from the inside out and now like I said this year I'm going to be working on outer health body health and I'm going to be integrating them which is so beautiful but I went inside out so healing shadow work um, meditating and doing all these things I had some sessions with a friend who does like um, healing trauma healing and all that stuff and it's just been I just feel so good so I hope to pass all these energies through the screen so you can have more energy feel younger and all that stuff if you want to dive more into self-love and all of these things please let me know what you guys want to see down below and I would love to like dive into that with you guys but I just thought I would chime in on that because because all of us want to work on the outside. This is January. It's a new year and everybody is worried about that. But I just want to say, really look to the inside first. And when that is healthy, you can be healthy on the outside. And that's where I'm at right now. So we can do this together. Okay, you guys, good morning. We are headed over to the pickleball fields. I just wanted to pop in before I show you what I'm doing and tell you that this year, I want you guys to be able to be so gentle with yourself because I know everybody wants to get in the gym and work hard, but if that approach didn't work for you in the past, I want to encourage you to try a different approach. So this year, just try to move your body and find things that you love to do. So me and my husband are on our way to go play pickleball. You don't even feel like you're working out. I think he clocked like 600. Um, calories on his watch and I was like it's already over so walk literally walking helps so much my husband has been telling everybody like it's the life hack so if you guys just want to start working out but you don't know where to start start by walking start by doing things that you love I'm going to play pickleball let's go dripping sweat sweating bullets out here I'm like running these courts I'm like number one okay actually not but <laughs> 
Here is the gym at our RV park that we're currently staying in. And it's usually just very basic, elliptical. This one has a bike, not sure what that is. We have two treadmills here and it's a Saturday, so nobody's in here. And then around the corner here, they have a whole weight stand, weight rack, two benches. We have a trampoline and a stand-up bag. So I think it's perfect for what I need to get done and you know, you just get creative on what workouts you need to do. All right, you guys, I'm getting ready to show you how I make my vision board. I thought I would add it into this video. There's so many more things that I wanna show you guys how I'm resetting this year and this month. If you guys are interested, let me know down below if you guys are enjoying the video, but I am making a vision board. This is gonna be my essence, my energy, my vibes I'm having for 2023 that are gonna be on my computer screen, my iPad, and it's just, a very casual way of doing a vision board. I know people put like houses and all of these very specific things, but mine are more of like just the vibe and energy that I wanna see in 2023. So I'm excited to share this with you guys. I create this by using Canva. I will link it down below for you guys. It's C-A-N-V-A and it's absolutely free unless you wanna to upgrade to like the business one or the professional one. But I screenshot pictures from Pinterest by, I either do like aesthetic food or aesthetic whatever you can even type in like pink food or whatever you want your aesthetic of your vision board to be you can type that into the search bar and so many things will pop up i'm sure even if you do google those things will pop up as well but i'm excited to share this portion of the video with you let's get into it a couple of things i wanted to share with you guys look at my ipad cover it is so freaking cute and i got these off of etsy i will link the store down below but look at I also got one for my computer. I think they match pretty good. They're both like in the beige family. I've been into beiges lately. I still like pink, I still buy pink stuff, but I buy more beige stuff for like travel and office and that I just want it to match everything, you know? So who am I? Okay, you guys, so what I did, I'm on Canva right now and I put in desktop wallpaper, okay? So I'm gonna upload all of my pictures. You go to uploads here and now I'm gonna go to upload files and we're gonna go to downloads because I sent them from my phone. So what I do is I screenshot it from Pinterest and now I'm taking all of those images. So now they're gonna be uploading and that this is gonna take a little bit for them to upload. But once they're all on here, now you can kind of play with it. And I just picked this one because it looked very clean and sleek. And that way I can kind of reconfigure things as I need to. But these aren't very big files so they shouldn't take very long. These pictures here, I'm gonna replace. So like, I'm gonna take this picture and I'm gonna put it over that one, okay? And then, so like for me, this is rest. So this is where it gets really fun. You can just start plugging things in wherever you see fit. So anyways, if you can see, we're just moving things around. This one has kind of some like geometric shapes. You can delete those if you don't want them. And like this one has a notebook and a computer, which is good. I already kind of had something like that online. So this is so fun. I love doing this. This one says, live with intention. You are worthy of love. This is more of the essence of the year. This is an energy that I'm bringing to the year. This isn't things that I have to accomplish, okay? That will be for my goal setting later on, which even then, I'm not gonna be that strict on myself. So now I've covered their pictures and now I get to start adding my own pictures and this is so it's not I'm not even doing their layout anymore all right you guys so here it is I fixed and arranged everything the way that I wanted it to so I have just a little bit of luxury here some places where I want to make sure I rest some pictures of self-care it looks so different to me this year Self-care, I really want to like go within. This also represents more reading and journaling and love. You are worthy of love, quality time. My currency is time. So for me, it's more important that I spend time with my family than accomplishing any goals. I'm just at a different place in my life now that I'm a full-time RVer. I have a very good perspective on how valuable our time is because we're not promised tomorrow. I lost my grandma last year and I just really value being with my family and honestly just waking up every morning. I'm so grateful that I'm alive. Air travel, definitely wanna do that. 
got some gym stuff here, uh, my spirituality, making sure that I cleanse my energies. And um, I really want to work on that this year. I did so much healing last year. I still want to continue working on my healing, but I feel like I've already arrived to a place where I don't worry about the future. I don't worry about the past. I literally am able to just focus on the now. And it has been such a beautiful place to be. But I have this flat lay here that kind of represents like my work and making things beautiful. And um, I have some healthy stuff. I have three people choosing here because I want some more friendship connection. I met some beautiful friends this year and it's been so much fun. So I want to, you know, work on friendships and um, enjoying my time with them as well and having more connection. But this is it on my computer. I love the way that it turned out. And like I said, like for me, this is very a relaxed version. I put words up here that are special to me and pictures and it's just it's not so specific, you know what I mean? This is just what I'm gonna be seeing all the time and the energy that I wanna bring to 2023. And then I will definitely write down my goals for work and things like that. If you guys are interested, I can share with those, share those with you as well. Oh my gosh, let me show you guys. Like, look how cute this is. This is my, um, it looks like a purse, but it's actually my tech bag. So let me know if you guys wanna see this in the next video, but I keep all of my techie stuff in here and I just think it's so cute. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed that 2023 reset. Let me know if this was enjoyable to you because I would love to do maybe a reset every quarter, every month. Let me know if this is something you'd be interested in so we can keep each other motivated. Thank you guys for watching my video. I am back and I'm ready to get back to business. So if you guys have not done so, don't forget to subscribe, hit that little bell and come say hi in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I'm always your girl, Lorna Marie. Bye.